Hello and welcome to this demo of readthewords.com multi-voice editor. Over the years we've had a lot of inquiries from our members asking if it was possible to create a single recording out of multiple voices. Uh, the fact remains that Read the Words always had this facility but it was pretty hard and cumbersome to use it. So to solve that problem we came up with this new feature called the multi-voice editor. And I'll just show you how this works. You go to convert text page and you see the familiar interface where whatever you enter here is going to be spoken by the voice which is selected from the drop down. Now in case you want to create a recording with more than one voice, click on the multi voice editor link here which opens a page, a new page which shows an empty grid. Uh, what the multi voice editor does is that it breaks your entire recording text down into a series of rows and columns where each row represents the voice and what it's going to speak. So let me just enter some sample data here. As you can see, in order to enter something, I just double click on the column and I can either select the voice and I can choose and I can also choose the text it's going to speak. For the text, I can either type it by hand or I can paste the text from some other source. Uh, so you can just go on entering as many rows as you require and if you want to add a new voice, you just click on the last empty row and you can enter the data. If you want to remove a row, just click on Dell and that particular voice and the text goes away. Once you're ready with your content, you just click on the save button. What happens after that is Read the Words automatically converts all those rows and columns into a format which it understands. As you can see, you have voice tags here in the text and you just enter some name here and you once you click on the create audio file, it will create the recording with all the voices you've specified. So as you can see, it's a very, very simple way of uh, making a recording with multiple voices. In case once you've created a recording or saved a recording with multiple voices, you want to edit or change it, you can just click on the editor link again and it automatically loads whatever data has been entered so far and you can go on adding your changes and updates to it. So that's it folks. I hope you have a great time using this new feature and we are always happy to receive any kind of feedback from you. Thank you.